What's going on? Sitting here in the VP of Sales office, Charlie Chena. Sitting in, he's got these, look, really nice, comfortable leather chairs. He's got a bar in his office. Everybody. How do I how do I get all that? I don't drink, bro. I know you don't drink. But you got a little cool looking bar thing over there. I don't have any of this stuff. Hey Barbara. Barbara's in here. Michael Bazo, I saw you in there. So yeah, just um sitting here talking some business. Appreciate you guys jumping on here. There's Deborah, Leanne Smart, Justin Myers. What's up, bro? How you doing, man? What's up, Michael Bazo? What's going on? So, yeah, we're just uh, sitting here talking some business. And uh, I said, hey, where's David Delgado? He said, who knows? Who knows where that clown is? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Delgado's a cool dude. Carrie Ann Tobin just joined. What's up, Carrie Ann? Yeah, Charlie loves you. Randy Hunt, what's up, bro? Scott, Dr. Scott Colonna is in the house. Dr. Scott, my goodness, how you doing, bro? Um, just got off the phone with, with Scott Colonna. Let me, let me show you guys the real champion of Lightspeed VT. Look, there he is. Charlie Chena right there. I zoomed way in on you, dude. What's happening? Everybody's saying, what's up? Hey, thank you guys for sharing. I appreciate that. Michael Bazo, thank you for sharing. Um, Carrie Ann said, hi, Charlie. Let's get a look at that fashion statement. Look, he's got the cufflinks. He's got the jackets. Dude, I got the light speed cufflinks. Shut right. up. Come on, Dude, man. You don't have, not even Ken Walls. Let has me see. These. What do you got? What do you got? These were given to me by me Brad see. Lee. Let me zoom in here. Wow, look at that, man. Old school right there. That's old school. That's alumni stuff. What's up, Todd Crockett? How you doing, bro? That's alumni stuff. TC. Todd Crockett and his wife stopped by here the other day. Look at all this stuff Charlie's got hanging in his office in here. Some craziness going on in here. So we're kind of, uh, might be able to get old Charlie to lay down some, some advice for you. I don't know. He said he's feeling tired. I said, well, we need to do a Facebook Live, man. Do a Facebook Live to lighten or get you lit up in here. Carrie Ann Tobin. See, if Charlie knew more about what I'm trying to teach him, he would just go ahead and get on this stream and share it out to his friends. <laughs> He's got his phone in his hand. So, uh, hey, Chelsea, how are you? Walls of Steel. Hashtag. What's up, Stephen Fout? What's going on, y'all? So, what's yeah. Up? What's up? What's up? Hey, he's saying what's up, what's up. I got the camera on me now, man. So, hey, how is it we only have nine people in here? How's that even possible? Well, you were popular, bro. Yeah, what happened? Oh, ten. Got ten people now. Wow. We're just jamming. So, um, you guys have any questions for me or for Charlie? What is up, Stephen Fout? Hey, he's Stephen saying, what's up, Charlie Chena? CC? He's saying CC. Ask, ask a tough question. I'll answer him. Stephen Fout said Grant is probably live. I didn't see that. Aaron Marshall's in the house. Hey, hey, what's up, Aaron Marshall? Jay Barry, what's going on? Come on, man. Yeah, the numbers the, the numbers are a little off sometimes, I think. Appreciate all the thumbs up, the hearts. Oh, yeah, I don't see any hearts or thumbs up. But hey, thank you for the shares. If anybody did share it, it's not notifying me, but thank you. Appreciate that. Um, who needs a white? There's some sad faces. Don't, sad. So don't, sad? don't be sad. Why don't give me, oh, there's some anger faces. Wow, somebody's angry. Jason Alt, just talked to Jason a little bit ago too, man. What's going on, bro? So yeah, I just came in here to ask Charlie a question, and man, look, he's got, it's almost like a nice doctor's office or something. He's got these real nice leather chairs in here. It's nice and comfy. 
He overlooks the ocean. Oh, no, that's the parking lot. But it's still a nice office. Very nice office. So you invited GC. Thank you. Appreciate that. Grant Cardone. Grant's been on my live streams before a couple times, maybe a few times. So, um, Jay Barry, I see you. As Hank Norman would say, just give us the real deal, Ken. The gritty details and all. Hey, man, what, um, what, what details you want? What do you want? What can I give you? I just want to jump on and say, hey, I know Hank's like, you know, Hank, sometimes I feel like he's talking to me. <laughs> But, like, you know, I just get on and, and I talk, man. I talk. That's it. And 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 I try to keep it as real as I can. I don't, you know, I'm, I, I, I don't do a lot of swearing and shit like that on here. Oops, I just did. But, you know, um, going live, best topics. The best topics. Well, if you're asking me what the best topics would be, the best topics would be... Whatever you're an expert at, talk about that. What are you good at? Talk about that. Then you are actually, then you are actualizing that already. Actualizing what? Um, is that all, is that notifications from this? Is it? Dude, you're blowing up. <laughs> no, I'm not, dude. That's funny. <clears throat> By the way, if you're not friends with Charlie Chena, yet that's this guy right there if you're not friends with that guy send him a friend request for the love of god and everything else holy never have enough friends brother never have enough so carrie ann is bringing up questions are the answers there's this book written by a guy out of australia called questions are the answers his name is alan pease and he's some kind of a network marketing guy I, I'm not sure um, but you know he's he's um, the this book this tiny little book it's very actually pretty hard to get but um, this book that he wrote is called questions are the answers and it's the secret to selling just about anything if you have a product or a service that you're you're trying to sell and you know too many people come at come at sales as like Hey, this is what I've got, and this is what you need, and I want to sell it to you, and it's this price, and, and then close, 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 which is kind of not the way to do it. I'm just saying, you know, you want to find out um, what problem you can solve for the customer, what their goals are, what they want to accomplish with your product or your service. And the only way to do that is, is, is you know, you can't, like, you know, if I sold cars, I wouldn't wait on people to walk up and go, hey, you need this red Trans Am. <laughs> they don't even, do they make Trans Ams anymore? <laughs> they don't. Oh, shit. Hey, not only do they not make Trans Ams, they don't make Pontiacs. <laughs> they, oh, that's automobiles. right. I knew that. I knew that. So, uh, what's up, Stephen Walker? So, the Leilani, how you doing? It was awesome hanging out with you last weekend. So, you know, if I was selling cars, though, I wouldn't tell people what they need. I would ask people what they're looking for. You're looking for a two-door, four-door, you, you, a convertible or a hardtop. What are you looking for? You want an SUV or you want to, hey, there's Stephanie Delgado. We know where she is. She's on my live stream. Don't know where David is, though. But, um... Oh, dude, why do you have to say it like that? I'm just that kidding. Guy, dude. The guy's working. Where do you think he's at? I know he is. So anyway, I'm just teasing. So anyway, um, yeah, I'm just saying, like, you know, that book, Questions Are the Answers, the way that you sell something to somebody is you, you help them discover what the problem is they're trying to fix. You find out what they what they want, not what you want them to have. Although, look, if you're selling things, you know, there might be things that you're selling that, well, if I sell this, it's got a higher commission on it or whatever. But, you know, hey, if it doesn't fit what they're looking for, then you're going to experience the whole, hey, let me think about this until, you know, the cows come home. And, and, and you're never going to figure out why you can't close deals. You close deals by, by solving problems. And you close deals by asking people what they're looking for. 
and then you just you help them fix that problem you help them you know achieve their dreams so let me talk to the wife right what do you say then I know what you say what if she says no Leilani it was awesome hanging out with you you're awesome thank you for the hearts Leilani I see you I see your hearts you're awesome nobody else is giving me hearts there's David Delgado, cash money. He said cash money. <laughs> Where is he? Where I went. Uh, solve their problem, be the answer. And, and you know, don't, uh, there's no need to be overbearing. And, and I mean, you know, it's one thing to, to say, you know, hey, I'm going to follow up un until one of us dies. And I love that. That's Grant Cardone, right? So I'm going to follow up until one of us dies, you know, but like if you solve the problem and you 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 come up with a good solution that's you know cuz i don't think anybody would call lightspeed vt or call anywhere else for that matter like you wouldn't walk onto a car lot and expect something for free so you know if if you're talking to people about your product or your service obviously there's some kind of a need they have something is there so all you have to do is find out what that is. You're not going to find out what that is by telling them what it is. It's not going to happen. Anything you say to one of your prospects that you're telling them, in their mind, it's a lie. They're, they're going to question it. It came from you, not them. But if you ask them questions and let them tell you what their problem is or what they want, there's a good chance that you may be able to solve that problem for them. Questions are the answers. That's a little, and it's a multi, it's an MLM book. It's for network marketing, but it, it applies to anything. It really does. It, it just teaches you how to communicate better by asking the right questions. Anyway, so I just want to hop on real quick, say what is up? Really, Charlie? You know what's up. There he you is. You don't have right to there. ask. They know what's up. <laughs> Just wanted to. Hey, Frank Sell, how you doing? I mean, that dude, you know. Why can imagine sell. if I had that name, Frank, like with the last name Sell? <laughs> I know. You can't make that up. Yeah, I know, huh? man. Frank definitely can sell. Scott, Dr. Scott Colonna, I will work on that. So, yeah, look, David Delgado. Tell them the story of how you looked Charlie in the eye and carded his client. <laughs> David, that was all planned out, man. Listen, so, that wasn't that. Listen, you carding my client wasn't <laughs> as bad as the Facebook Live that I did today when David was holding my camera you mean backwards. When he was holding it like that, sideways. Buddy, listen, I appreciate it. You could have said yeah, no. That's right. Some exposure right. is better than no exposure. That's right. That is right. Dario Rosario just said, Dario said, Charlie, great guy. Charlie is a great guy. What's up, Lee Haight? How you doing, bro? What's up, Lee Haight? How are you doing? Hey, David Delgado just said you need, oh, that's why. What? You need an iPhone, dude. iPhone doesn't do that. It automatically adjusts. Whatever. We're trying to get Charlie into the into 2017 here. <laughs> he hates me. Anyway, um, at least I have feelings for you, bro. <laughs> he, said, he said, "At least I have feelings for you." That's funny. Anyway, all right. Hey, thanks for jumping on. Appreciate you all being here on my stream. Um, I like I said, just wanted to pop in, say what's up, get some get some uh, energy flowing in this office here, and hopefully be able to help somebody out along the way. So hopefully I helped you in some way, and if I didn't, if I didn't um, help you, then just keep coming back. Maybe one of these times I will. And hey, feel free to shoot me an email. Ken.walls at lightspeedvt.com if you have any questions. If you're a client of Charlie's, feel free to hit me up. I'll help you out. <laughs> I'm just kidding. 
<laughs> totally <laughs> kidding. Serious. No, I'm not serious. There goes Charlie walking oh, away. Look, it. it's five o'clock. Everybody's leaving. Staying yeah, at the elevator. Bye. All right. So, um, oh, you came in late. Came in late, Mark. Watch the replay. I was talking about questions are the answers. So anyway, thank you guys. Appreciate all of you. Oh, yeah, you didn't get your taffy. You live in California. Go get some. <laughs> I'm not, I don't steal clients, man. I would never do that. Dude, go, look, Leilani, go get some taffy. You live in California. So, um, all right, I am going to bounce. I have... I have a client I got to talk to. So appreciate you guys. Appreciate each and every one of you being on here. Thank you for the hearts, the the wow faces, the thumbs up, the shares. Thank you for sharing. Really appreciate all of it. You guys are awesome. Becky Farius, good to see you. I was literally just getting off here. So thank you guys. Appreciate all of you. Have a great night. And I hope you are blowing up this week. Go kill it. Peace out.